So, um, hello Lazara, thank you for uh, this interview. So, let's be honest, we've been chatting in French for 10 minutes. So, uh, <laughs> I, I, I have to ask you in English, how are you feeling today? I'm feeling great. I'm uh, feeling great. I'm having an amazing day. Is it? Yeah. So, so how, and how, how do you feel? <laughs> uh, I'm feeling okay. Actually, I'm feeling quite quite okay. Thank you for asking. Um, how is the Eurovision experience so far? Uh, quite exciting. Um, a little bit a little bit stressful, but uh, we can handle it since uh, I'm a strong woman, huh? And uh, yeah, I can't wait. I can't wait uh, to be the 13th of May. Okay, can you explain how did you uh, end up as the French representative for 2023? Well, it was um, Alexandra Red who came uh, to meet with me and she had a vision. She wanted me to represent France. Uh, she got um, acquainted with my, my work on my first album. And we talked, we talked uh, uh, around dinner and, and then I took some time to think about it. And here I am, I accept and here I am. Okay, so what's the story behind uh, Evidemment? It's a story of uh, love self, um, being strong enough to take your, your, um, your path in your own hand, uh, regardless of uh, of your surrounded thing and uh yeah it's uh it's a uh, it's a song for everybody no matter what job you do no matter what what is your dream sometimes you you have to to bury the person that you were before to be able to to go further and to achieve your goals okay um what can you expect from lazara uh, on liverpool stage um class um lights um i want people to have chills i want them to be like if they go in the museum and they see a really nice painting or a really nice piece of art i want them to to be like okay we never saw that so that's our goal for for liverpool okay so uh, i suppose you cannot reveal anything about the staging i can uh, otherwise Alexander is gonna appear yeah. in the back i know kill me. She can be quite fierce sometimes. <laughs> um, anyhow, but can you reveal something about the outfit? Um, sensual? Like the one in the music fierce? video? More amazing oh. than that. Haute uh, couture. Haute couture. Haute couture, yeah. Haute couture, yes, because it's going to take a month to do the dress. And, um, or not the dress and uh, <laughs> it's just gonna be very french yeah so uh speaking about france um you live in france now yes yes uh but you're a canadian so how does it feel mm. to be a canadian uh, at eurovision i feel very proud of being canadian and representing france um i feel french too you know, because I live here, it's been three years that I do back and forth, but now I'm, I'm here for, for good. And uh, yes, I, I feel honored and blessed and I just hope to be able to, um, you know, don't let down the country and win this competition. Uh, you know that uh, Australia is taking part to Eurovision. Uh, do you think that would be a good idea to let Canada participate? If you do that, everybody's going to be in big, big trouble. Wow. Because we have quite big artists over there. As you can see, we have a, a lot of uh, good artists. <laughs> but anyhow, they are preparing a Canadian version of Eurovision. So maybe uh, you could maybe, also, yes. yeah, maybe you could participate. Um, so far, uh, what, what has been your biggest surprise about this Eurovision fever? Um... I wasn't expecting that it was uh, that, no, I'm not going to say that big, but it's like another world, you know, it's a different world. Your vision is a different, it doesn't live in the same, you know, uh, uh, reality. It's different. It's a bubble, <laughs> and it's, yeah. Yeah, yeah, but people are really nice. 
usually <laughs> and you can feel the love and you can feel the passion uh, of the people and uh, yeah people are there for entertainment for music and to connect so that's great it's amazing it's the first time i experienced something like that uh, have you listened to the other songs yes of course uh, not everything but i think i got through a, a bunch of them and it's amazing it's very original every time you can see the authenticity and people really try to represent the roots of the country so that's amazing and you have great vocalists great performers so i think it's going to be a really really great show this year yeah i think it's a high level this year indeed yeah um so to finish uh you've been answering so many questions i suppose do you have one question for me or for esc fans in general um uh, i'm not good at that. <laughs> that's a job <laughs> yeah that's a job it is you know <laughs> but um no I, I, it's really hard you put me on the, on the spot right <laughs> It's okay. Listen, I think uh, you have a very busy evening tonight. So uh, we're going to say au revoir. Thank you very much for this interview. Merci beaucoup. Ciao.